Hi, this is Gary with MacMost Now. Today let's learn how to use a personal domain with your MobileMe website. Now I believe that everybody who has a web presence, whether it's MobileMe or one of the free blogging services, should have their own domain name. It doesn't really cost much at all and without having one it's like introducing yourself using somebody else's name. So go to a web registrar of your choice, anyone you want, spend 8 or 10 bucks and get yourself a domain name. Make it something funny, make it your name, make it anything you want, but then get one and then apply it to your service like MobileMe. Now MobileMe lets you set up a website and most people do this using the iWeb application. There's a lot of different options. You can create some pretty cool websites. But when you're done what you have is a website at web.me.com slash your username which is no good. You should have your own domain name. So after you register your domain name at a registrar here's what you do to set it up as your MobileMe domain. So you log in to your MobileMe account. You go to me.com, log in and then click on the account information icon at the top which is the furthest one to the right. looks like a little shadow person. Then you click on the left for personal domain and you get the screen where you can add your personal domain. So you're going to enter in the domain name that you registered like example.com here. And you confirm that and then you're ready to go to the next step. Now you get a screen of information from MobileMe telling you you need to go to your domain registrar and change the C name to www.me.com. Let's look at exactly how to do that. So let's use GoDaddy as an example since it seems to be the most popular registrar at the moment. You go into your account and you find the domain name that you assign to your me.com website. You go ahead to edit the information about that. You'll find a lot of different things there but what you want to do is edit the DNS records. In GoDaddy's case it's called the total DNS. When you get to that part you'll see a bunch of information there and you want to go ahead and click to edit that. When you edit it you'll come to another screen with a lot of different bits of information about your DNS. DNS stands for Domain Name Server. You want to look for the C names and you want to look for the www C name. You want to go ahead and use the uh, account editing there to edit it and change it to web.me.com. Now here's the thing about making changes to your domain name. It doesn't happen right away. You see there's domain name servers all over the internet and they all need to be updated for everybody to see your website using that domain name. So when you make the change at your registrar what will happen is slowly but surely over the next 48 hours all the domain name servers in the world will update to know that that domain points to your MobileMe website. So for you it just takes that one domain server that you're using to actually see your new domain. Could happen in the next hour, could take two days. It's really hard to tell. And once that happens people will be able to go to www. whatever your domain is dot com and then go to your MobileMe website. Now if you want to go ahead and actually have it work without the www it's a little trickier. Every domain name registrar is a little different. For instance in GoDaddy's case there's something called forwarding and you can actually set your entire domain name to forward to the www account. So in other words if somebody types in example.com it will go to www.example.com which is your mobile me account. There's a lot of different tutorials at different domain name registrars about this. Now if you're still having trouble and you're not using GoDaddy well there's a lot of different tutorials out there. As a matter of fact the best place to look is most of the domain name registrars have forums and the people discuss different issues that they have. And just about everyone at this point has a discussion about how to set up MobileMe. So go ahead and look in your forums for your domain name registrar to set it up. Once you've done this you can then proudly point people to your domain name that you own and goes to your MobileMe website. Another great advantage of this is if you ever decide to switch, say go to a more advanced web solution, you can take your domain name with you and point it at your new website. So you don't have to tell everybody where your new web address is. You can simply point your new domain name to your new site and it's all taken care of. Till next time this is Gary Rosenzweig with MacMost Now.